wonder why the Prez sent for us this time. Don't know, but he sounded seriously stressed out. We got here as fast as we could, sir. You said it was an emergency? It's a conference. He's down in his lab and hasn't answered any of my calls. He didn't even come out for his lunch. Well, maybe he isn't hungry, but I sure am. Excuse me. I'm worried something might have happened to him. You mean like maybe he got nailed by his Murphy bed? Again? Or some netherworld attack. We better check it out. Unfortunately, all the entrances are locked, so I was hoping you could find some other way in. No problem, Mr. Prez. Titanium Pac-Man can handle it. Oh. How awesome is that? Is back. Ghost chomping at his feet. Packs our hero. Pack just can't be beat. Yeah. Pack that yellow pack. He's green. He's a chowing down machine. Yo, monster goons. And only one can stop him. The pack is back. Ghost chomping at his feet. Packs our hero. Pack just can't be beat. The pack is back. Too, Fuzzbits, but Cersei still needs to invent some super strong breath mints for you. What's going on? You tell me, silly. Why did young Pack drill a hole in my ceiling? <laughs> the president thought you might be in trouble. Oh, not me, but Grinder's been having a tough time with these pesky chompers. <laughs> Steady now, Grinder. What is this thing? Shh, it's a tip tip top secret. And frankly, too soon to tell what the heck I was thinking when I started. However, I'm certain that when it's finished, it will help protect Pac World from Netherworld invasions. <coughs> oh, which reminds me, I'm glad you dropped in. <laughs> I could use your help securing the latest element necessary to complete my invention. Sir, sure, whatever you need. It's called Slime Tanium, and it's only found in the Netherworld. <laughs> Don't worry, Fuzzbits. You never have to see the netherworld again. Uh, what exactly is slime tanium? No, oh, I'm way too busy to chat right now, but come back tomorrow and we'll have plenty of time to talk slime tanium before journeying into the netherworld. <laughs> Ugh, this better be good, buttocks. Oh, better than good, your insidiousness. Behold, my new brain suck device which can suck intelligence and memory from any mind into this little bottle. So, your device sucks. Exactly! Allow me to demonstrate. Oh, no! Ah! Oh, yeah! Oh, no! Voila! My brother's limited IQ is now bottled by Botox, leaving him a thumb-sucking zombie. In fact, a vast improvement. <laughs> I'm sure glad we weren't the ones that got brain-drained. Gee, you think? Hmm, not bad. Now all I need is to capture Pac-Man and suck the brains right out of him, leaving him a vacant lemon ball. <laughs> Over my dip! Okay, I'm over it. Put Butler's brains back. I need my lunch served. Oh, if you insist. <laughs> One of these days. I sure hope Packy isn't planning on visiting the Netherworld. Ever again.
We've just picked a fresh supply of power berries, so we're ready to hit the netherworld. You just need to tell us where we'll find the slimetanium. Excellent! Uh, what's up with that? Stylish, isn't it? I invented it, so I won't need berry power to withstand the netherworld environment on our little adventure today, eh, Grinder? Our little adventure? You're not coming with us. And <laughs> why not? I was a fearless freedom fighter in my time, as you well know. Sorry about that, bitch. But still, pretty good moves if I do say so myself. And I do! But maybe... Remember, once completed, my new invention will help protect Packworld. Besides, you'll need my scientific expertise to extract the slime-tanium. Eh, he's got us there. Are you sure this is such a good idea, Pinky? Duh! I need to get to Pack World and warn Packy to never set foot in Netherworld again! Yo, here comes your would-be boyfriend now! I've had it with your cruel jokes, Buster! No joke! Look! Berry power rocks! It's the only way to fly! <laughs> Not really! Pack's headed straight for a brain stop! I'm not glad to see you, because you've got to get out of Netherworld now before Lord B captures you and Heine Head sucks out your brains! Uh, anyone have a clue what she's ranting about? But Traeus wants to turn you into a mindless zombie! A lemon drop with no juice! Fresh squeeze! My disembodied brethren aren't exaggerating! You need to scram! Can't! Gotta find an ingredient for a really important invention Cersei's working on. Indeed he does! Slime-tanium! Hmm, I believe the layman's term is Cyclopean Igu, generally derived at great peril from a sleeping Cyclops ghost. Precisely! Aw, oh, you've gotta be kidding! This is a joke, right? Not at all. In fact, I'll need the Igu of two Cyclops ghosts to complete my invention. Igu times two? No way! <gasps> I do happen to know just where a couple of Cyclops ghosts like to nap, and it's right. Well Put a sock in it! If Petraeus finds out we're helping Pac-Man, he'll suck our brains out! Guess we'll have to find the Cyclops ghost on our own. Come on, guys. I'm not afraid of Petraeus. Well, maybe a little, but I'll... Try it again, and I'll suck your brains out of your nose! I think she means it. For sure. This way to the Cyclops snapping zone. Follow me, freedom fighters! Excuse me? Oop, sure thing, no problem. Oh, 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 yeah. Uh, what's with him? Cersei is just uh, excited to be back in action. <laughs> Lucky us. Pinky. Anything for you, Packums. And here's a hug for good luck. Uh, thanks. Anything for you, Packums. <laughs> no time to lose. Onward, freedom fighters. Easy, Cersei. It's narrow in there. Indeed. It requires nimble footwork. Watch and learn, my boy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Perhaps the cavern was a bit narrow. I suggest we continue on foot. Gotcha! Oh! 
Definitely sounds like Cyclops snoring. Let me take it from here, Cersei. one. Grinder, we're all still in one piece. Uh, barely. Well, I guess I made a mess of the mission, but at least we got half the slime tanium I need to complete my new invention. I don't know what your building circumference, but nothing is worth risking Pack having his brain drained. Huh? No joke. Uh, no need to say more. Uh, I can tell you think this freedom fighter is over the hill. Then maybe you're right. 
Sir C sure looked bummed. Maybe he messed up today, but he has created loads of awesome stuff. That always ends up helping to save Packworld. Come on! Let's go back and tell Cersei we'll find some way to get the rest of the Slimetanium he needs. You got it! Down with that! <coughs> what are you saying, Fuzzbits? None of us speak monster! Uh, circumference? <gasps> You're saying that Cersei went back to the Netherworld alone? Grinder didn't go with him? <laughs> oh no! What if they captured Circumference and suck out his brain? We gotta get back to the Netherworld fast! You wait here, Fuzzbits. Yeah, it's like way too dangerous for you to ever go back there. <laughs> Aw, Fuzzbits doesn't care. He loves Sir C too, so he's gonna help us track him, right? I'll show those young whipper packers I'm not past my prime. Once a freedom fighter, always a freedom fighter. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you mean once an old fool, always an old fool? Bring him to me! Uh, wasn't the Cyclops cave in the other direction? Unless I'm wrong, and I sure hope I am, this leads to Petraeus's castle. Then that means Cersei is probably already a prisoner! Oh, I can hardly wait to bring Sock Circumference! It will be quite an honor to steal the most brilliant mind ever! Besides mine, of course. Oh, think of all the knowledge that Hack World will lose and the Nether World will gain! <laughs> no, I would much rather have the Pac Man than this kooky old coot. But go ahead, suck out what little sense he has left. Well, Doctor, if I have to become a brainless boob, <laughs> at least I fall into a worthy opponent. <laughs> I just wish, before my mind turns to mush, that I knew how this brilliant invention works. Actually, it's ingeniously simple, really. Enough! Or I'll suck out your inflated ego, but I'll need a bigger bottle. <laughs> right away, your insistentness. This is bad, really bad. Get that traitorous fuzzball and get this thing off of me! <laughs> this might go better if you stood still, my lord. <laughs> I really do need to work on those breath mints. <laughs> Don't even think about sucking my brain! A grinder. Oh, thanks, grinder. I got my own wings. Let's go home, freedom fighters. You coming, Paxter? Just got a couple of twin backsides to take care of. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
Heads. We're sorry we ever doubted you. No joke. Think you could teach us some of your moves? Oh, sure thing. Got home safe with the eye goo, too. So, exactly what are you building? That remains to be seen, Cylindria. <laughs> but I promise you three will be the first to know. May I proudly present the Lemon Rocket. This is the first genetic hybrid in history. I used Pac-Man's DNA to create this extraordinary vehicle, which, thanks to Slimetanium, AKA Cyclops Igoo, also has cruise and climate control for down under or up yonder in space. Oh, awesome. Wow. Way cool. Would you do the honors, pac my boy Hello, am I yellow? Whoops. Well, maybe I should have left Circumference locked up in his lab. 